welcome back and today we're going to be reacting to 17's Fallen Flower dance practice and along with that I was also going to react to the um uh a couple other ones I getting closer and um we're, we're gonna get to them I, I kind of forgot which ones I picked besides Fallen Flower I apologize but <laughs> you guys will know by the title anyway so uh Anyways, let's just get into the first one here. Three, two, one, ba. And the thing cool about this one is, you know, a lot of it isn't even really shown in the music video, so I'm really interested to see the full dance. Gosh, it's just like their their dances are so crazy. This dance is like so intense. By the way, guys, this is the uh, the mirrored version, so if this doesn't look right to you, that is why. Oh, this, it's just, it's like, it's crazy. Like, this is like probably like one of the craziest choreos that I've ever seen. But yeah, this this is just it's so cool. They're like masters of timing, synchronization, pace. And I'm just specifically talking about the dancing, the singing and rapping. It's like a whole different story. Well, it's not a dance practice, but it's just like a, a choreography video, so, I mean, same thing, not really, but it, it was the closest thing I could find. So let's just get into it. Three, two, one. <laughs> they just, they had to make it so you couldn't mimic this one. Um, question mark? Oh, no. 
I was really excited to see this full choreo without the music video. Like, how do you just fall down without hesitation? They're just like, they're so graceful. Guys, I'm like kind of just sitting here enjoying the song too. <laughs> Gosh, I mean, like, just their their choreos and their songs have to get the crowd, like, really energized. Because they just, just from watching Seventeen through a screen, I just get energized, like, hyped up. Something about them, like, their, their stage presence, their presence in general is just amazing. It's a very, very amazing group, for sure. Um, I just feel like... I've never seen a group with some of these abilities ever before in my entire life. And by entire life, I mean like the last like six years. But still, let's just, let's just get into the last dance practice. Okay, on to the last um, dance practice. This one is Getting Closer. Uh, this song was just very, very lit, okay? Very lit, very hard. Uh, instrumental and uh, just very aggressive sounding song so I'm expecting this to be very amazing and aggressive choreography but let's just get into it three two one ba. what are they recording on Yep, this is exactly what I needed.
This choreo is just crazy. Button up shirt, that looks fire. Man, and their endurance too, like I just like they must get it like absolutely ex well, they can't be exhausted actually, because I mean well, and I take it back. They can be exhausted, but I mean, like when they're like performing live, you know, I've been, I've been to one K-pop concert, okay, myself, and you know, it seems like they really don't get like a lot of time, like maybe like a couple minutes in between, like every like few songs. It seems like they get, like for like changing and stuff. That seems like the the limit is like a a few like like five minutes maybe. So I mean, I feel like their endurance and is just very, very high to be able to do dances like this for um, extended periods of time, of course. But uh, anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed my reaction to these three dance practices, and I will see y'all in the next one. Peace.